Hey, what's up everybody? Thanks for tuning in to another video. Hey. Hello. Uh, hi. You want to play some video games? Hmm? No, man. I uh, I just started shooting this video, so I gotta work. Come on. It'll be fun. Uh, okay, maybe one game. Sorry, guys. I'll be back in a minute. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, come on. yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right. All right, man. I gotta get back to work. No, nah, man, you got all day to do that. Just one more game. Okay, one more. Eight hours later. <sighs> Whew, sorry guys. Uh, where was I? Right. Hey, what's up everybody? Thanks for tuning into another video. In this one, I wanted to talk to you guys a bit about laziness. I've always had a huge problem with laziness and procrastination and generally just a lack of motivation. For years, I just thought I was lazy because I smoked a lot of weed, but I haven't smoked weed in nearly a year and a half and guess what? I'm still lazy. I still spend a lot of hours just watching YouTube videos, hanging out, binging Netflix, playing a bunch of video games, or just mindlessly scrolling through social media feeds. So clearly weed wasn't the issue. It's not the thing that was causing me to be lazy. It had its own function and I'll get into that in another video if you want me to. But something else is causing my laziness. And I wanted to make this video to figure out what that is exactly. I thought maybe it could be depression. I wouldn't identify as a depressed person and I've definitely never been diagnosed with it. But I've had stretches of sadness just like everybody else. And during those times I am really unproductive. But those times of sadness come and go and it doesn't really change my amount of inactivity. Even when I'm happy and generally content with the rest of my life, I'm still pretty lazy. So if it's not depression and it's not addiction, what is it? I think one factor at play here is hedonism. I would consider myself a hedonist because I think I'm addicted to pleasure. Whether it comes from sex or food or drugs or entertainment or just like straight up relaxing. I crave anything that just gives me a quick dopamine hit. So I think what's going on is any free time that I get, I just automatically default to some sort of hedonistic practice. Luckily, I don't let these things ruin my life, but they definitely dominate my spare time. Because during my scheduled hours, I actually do really well. I'm not a weak-willed person at all. I'm kind of the opposite, actually. I'm very rigid. Like, if I'm on a diet, I'll stick to it completely. When I am going to the gym, I go all out. I'm never late for work or to meet up with a friend. Pretty much whatever I'm doing, I'm doing it diligently and to the best of my ability. I do really great with structure and routine, but it's the free time that I'm horrible with. I'm the type of person who is all or nothing. I tend to only work in extremes, and this is one of my biggest downfalls. I can't just halfway do something. I'm a bit of a perfectionist, and my mindset is if I can't do it perfectly, why do it at all? So I think that kind of bleeds over when I have spare time. I relax really, really well. So I've been thinking about how I can fix this and I haven't really come up with a good solution. One thing I was thinking about is just don't have free time, just fill up my schedule with other things, which seems like an okay solution on the surface, but ultimately I think would just cause problems. Eventually, I think I would just run out of steam and crash and then just go back to the other extreme and just stop doing all these productive things. So maybe a solution would be schedule out a slot of free time every day. But the problem with that is it's kind of allowing me to stay in this like rigid mindset, which is something I'm trying to not do. So again, that solution doesn't really work. Usually at the end of my videos, I have some sort of solution to offer, but this time I really don't. Instead, I'm gonna ask you guys for your help. If you guys have ever dealt with laziness and a lack of motivation, but you overcame it, please let me know in the comment section below what your secret is. That's it, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, click the like button down below. If you're new around here, please consider subscribing. I make videos every single week on a wide variety of topics, and I'd love to have you be a part of the conversation. Thanks for hanging out, you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.